Hello everyone, I am Ahad Jagger and today I'm going to show you how to get the estimated time I mean the estimated remaining time for the download on Epic Games whether it's a download or I mean uh, whether it's like a, an installation for a game for a new game or or whether it's uh, just an update for the existing games so let's get right into it because well I've tried to find other videos for that and I couldn't and I also tried to find posts about like the solution for it but there was uh, the I mean like no one knew the no one knew the solution so today I'm going to share this with you all so first let me explain this all right how we're going to do it let's take borderlands 2 as an example all right now i have already like downloaded some parts of it but you'll still get an idea all right here we go so before let me stop this for a second so you know that gigabyte one gigabyte equals to 1000 megabytes right just keep this in mind because we're gonna use it for something later on i mean soon and well when i was in grade seventh or eighth grade i learned that i learned a formula in maths it was distance equals to speed multiplied by time and we put this thing in a triangle so that it can uh, so that you will not forget it all right so yeah distance get, uh, equals to speed multiplied by time and the speed equals to distance by time and the time equals to distance by speed so now we know how to get the time but we still we need uh, to do something some conversion you see this gigabyte we gotta convert it because the speed is in megabytes we cannot we cannot have distance uh, in gigabyte and speed in megabyte all both of them have to be the same so in this uh, I mean like for now we're going to convert the gigabyte into megabyte so pull out your calculator whether it's real life or virtual all right and convert how to convert multiply by thousand take this 20.1 gigabyte multiplied by 1000 and you get 20,100 megabytes and to write that down all right so first let me write the formula so you understand t equals to d which is, which is the distance by time all right uh hold on let me fix that d yeah all right so okay let's continue wait yeah uh oh hold on what did i just do i mean d by s uh, that's just a little error right d by s distance by speed okay this is this is s okay this is s <laughs> okay so now we substitute what's the distance distance we got by converting that thing uh 20,100 megabytes and what's the speed well you it will vary from one game to another and from one connection to another but it, it will work with every single computer laptop so let's take uh, it, I mean like this could be like the maximum speed 11.3 we'll take it as 10.9 or 10.8 just in case so that will get more accurate results yeah so we put it here 10.8 all right and now we use the calculator again the distance divided by speed so we get the answer but it's in seconds and if you want to convert seconds into minutes you gotta divide it by 60 and you get 31 minutes congratulations and if you want to get in hours if it's such a big if it's such a like a, a long number still you can convert it to into hours by dividing it again by 60 get 0 0.5 hours which is half an hour 
or you could convert it back to minutes by multiplying by 60 and there you go 31 minutes hope you enjoyed it subscribe to my channel because this is the most uniquest video out i mean this video is unique and i have not seen a single video about this i hope this helps everyone out there see ya